Corrigano, and I'm from Delray Beach, Florida, but nobody, like everybody else's town, I've ever seems to know where that is, but it's in between West Palm Beach and Fort Lauderdale, right above Boca Raton. And a childhood memory of mine is watching the Dallas Cowboys with my dad, that's my dad. Um, so I really hated watching football when I was younger because I felt like it was never ending. I didn't know what was going on, but then I really grew up grew to learn to love it. And if you don't know, the Dallas Cowboys just got knocked out of the playoffs by the Rams. Um, and this, yeah, it's really salty about it, but not to mention my second favorite team happens to be the New Orleans Saints, who also just got yeah. knocked out Wrong. by the Rams. So that means I have to go for Thank the you. Patriots this year, which Ooh. is Boo. really hard for me. Um, but I can't for the team that knocked mine out, so. But to make myself feel better, I put up the five Super Bowl trophies of the Dallas Cowboys because the Rams have won, I think. So that means they're not even close. So that makes me feel better. Another childhood memory of mine is going to Sedona, Arizona and visiting my aunt and uncle and grandmother. And if you leave from South Florida to Sedona, it's about a five and a half hour flight plus a two hour shuttle ride or car ride to Sedona. So by the time you get there, you are wiped out, but it is so worth it. And I recommend that everybody goes there at least once in their lifetime because it is so beautiful. Um, another, oh, something that I am good at is cooking. My dad used to work with Wolfie well, Sodas, works long hours. So when I would come home from school, I'd be like in fifth grade and so forth. I would come home, watch the Food Network. I love, Love cooking, Johnny De Laurentiis, Bobby Flay, Ina Garden, you name it. I was cooking, and so today I really love cooking Asian food, Korean, Japanese, Thai, anything um, that you probably haven't heard of for specific dishes. So that's something I'm really good at. Something I'm working on is procrastination. So you can't really see it, but it says I'll do it tomorrow underneath the sloth, who is me, because I'm really hardworking and I really try to put my effort and I strive for that and everything I do, but it takes me a little bit of time to get started. So yeah, that's what I'm working on. A goal in life would be this cross right here. I really want to bring Jesus in everything that I do. I want people to know the love of Jesus. I want to represent him in what I do and just everything I do, I want him to be the forefront of it. Um, and then finally, three words that I want to be <coughs> in the funeral would be Compassionate, devoted, and that I have integrity. Compassionate, I really do believe that this will needs more kindness, and I'm always bound to be empathetic towards people. Um, and if you see me around campus and it looks like I have a resting face, I promise I'm not feeling that way on the inside. Um, devoted really goes hand in hand with my faith. I want people to know that I was devoted to Jesus and that I um, was just devoted in my work and my family and everything in between. And then finally, integrity. Honesty is really important to me. So I don't like lying. I don't like people lying to me. And I think that that has to go really well with integrity. And 